Hi there, welcome to Get Fit with Gosha and welcome to day three of your 21 day fitness challenge. So you've done two workouts so far, so have I, and to be honest, my legs are feeling really stiff today. So I decided today we're gonna do a little bit of Muay Thai, focusing on our upper body. So punches, little bit of kicks, not too much, and a little bit of core. So you don't need any equipment for this workout, so just grab your water, towel, good music, good attitude, and let's get this workout on the road. We're gonna start with a short warm up. All right, just light jog here on the spot, warming up the muscles, warming up the whole body, shake it out. Yeah, those legs are feeling pretty stiff. All right, now circle your arms. Try to keep your elbows straight. And up your arms back. If you've never done any boxing, kickboxing, do not worry, this is all very Simple, easy to follow, just enjoy and have fun. Elbows up, turn your body side to side. And yeah, you can do this workout without any shoes on, provided that you have a good floor, not too hard. All right, now circle your hips, big circles. Oh yeah, stretching out that whole body. And now change direction. Full range of motion, and now circle your knees all the way around. And now change direction. So we're gonna do four rounds today, and each round will have four exercises. All right, now circle your ankles, and there's no repeating of any exercises, so it's gonna go by really quickly. Change direction, and you can do this workout twice for a more complete workout, longer workout. All right, change sides and change direction and bring your hands together, circle your wrists, keep your hands together and now change direction and now open up your arms and kick it across. That's it. Don't overstretch it. Just bring it as high as you can. Start to engage the core. And we're gonna do one more warm up exercise. We're gonna do inch warm like we did yesterday. So breathe in, keep your knees straight. Breathe out, walk your body forward. We're gonna do it five times. Come to plank, engage, walk your hands back. Stand up, arms overhead, down. Walk your hands forward, engage the core. Come back and breathe in. And we have two more to go. Breathe in, out, and walk your hands back. And one more to go here. All right, let's get started. I'm gonna get my timer. I want you to start in a fighter stance with your left leg in front. We're gonna be doing both sides equally. So first interval with your left leg in front. Let me get my timer. All right, left leg in front, hold it here. Jab, cross, block. One, two, block. Just lift that left knee up. One, two, up. Rotating your shoulders forward. Do full extension with your arms as you punch. You have 45 seconds per side here. One, two, knee. One, two, knee. If you have good music, good beat, you can go to the beat. If not, have your own beat in your mind. Time. Change sides. Hands up, same thing here. Right, left, right knee. One, two. One, two. And you can make your own sound effects here too. One, two. Shadow boxing. 
It's a good workout for your upper body, that's for sure. Breathe out. Go at your own pace. Last one. All right, next exercise. Fast punches. We're going to move the arms and legs. So start jogging on the spot. Bring your hands up. There's no stance here. That means both feet at the same level. Let's go. 30 seconds here. Punch, punch, punch.
Feels good to punch. Almost there. Time. Next one is fast alternate hooks. So no stance. Bend your knees. Hands up. Engage your core. Let's go. So you don't have to go super fast. Still want to keep good technique. Turn your shoulders in. Turn your feet in. You can go a little bit slower. You can go faster. It's up to you. Always bring your hand back to your face. Next one, alternating tips. Tip is a push kick in Muay Thai. I'm gonna go sideways so you can see me. Bring your hands up, alternating. And then whatever leg you bring to the front, you swing that same hand back. And you want to point your toe up towards the ceiling. And if you would make contact, you would make it with the ball of the foot but this is no contact. Unless you come to the studio after MCO, join the Muay Thai classes, then you can punch, bang. And here, engage your core. Let's go. Time. Now, for our core, it's called <clears throat> London Bridge. You go in a side plank, I mean, sorry, in the elbow plank, and you bring your hips Exercise. side to side. You drop the hips, making your bum into a bridge. So turning on your tippy toes. Bring those hips as close to the ground as you can. Not so easy after a while. Finish strong. And time stand up. 30 second recovery. You can have some water. You're halfway. Round number three. So now, remember the tips you did in the last round? You're gonna go tip, hook, uppercut. So tip and hook are with your left leg on the first exercise. All right, let's get ready. Hands up. So you're gonna swing. The left hand back too. Ready? Let's go. Tip, hook, uppercut. Tip, hook, up. Tip, hook, up. Or you can just do tip, hook, up. If it's too confusing, you can just do that for today. That's totally fine. Tip. Three moves. One, two, one, two three. Last one. 
Now fast uppercuts. No stands here. And we're gonna move the legs too. All right, get ready. Start moving your feet. Punch it up. Go, 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 go. 20 seconds. Shake the body, come on, let's go. Get the heart rate going. Time. Woo. All right, now I'm gonna do oblique ducks. So you're like, you're ducking the punches. Not quack, quack, duck. Okay, let's go. Side to side. Don't stand too wide. Keep your elbows in. That's it. Nice. Try not to move your hips, just your upper body. I know it feels kind of strange. That's okay. Side to side, that's it. Nice. Feeling the obliques. All right, and lay down on the ground for bicycle crunches. All right, stretch your body out. Hands behind the neck. Lift your knees off the ground. Let's go. Point your toes. Go and add your own speed. Bring the elbow towards your opposite thigh. It doesn't have to touch. Just bring it towards that side. Keep going, another 20 seconds. Breathing through it. Stand up. We have one more round left. Grab a quick sip of water. Last round. Last combo. You're gonna do jab, knee strike. Okay, side view. Jab, knee strike. So, jab is with your left. Knee strike is with your right. Get yourself ready. Fire stance, hands up. Ready, let's go. Jab, knee. Try to swing that right hand back. As you do your knee strike, you have to point. Oh no, you don't have to. You should put your point, your toe down towards the floor. Add some power. Come on, last round here. Let's go. All right, changing your stance. Other side. Right and left. Now go. Right, left. Make sure you're breathing. That's why I'm doing this. That way I make sure that I breathe. But you can do whatever sound effects you want. Ha! 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 Power! Let's go! Ha! Ha! And time. All right, next one. Back to punches, but now we're gonna add jack legs to it. So get your feet together, hands together, let's go. Coordinating 
upper lower body. Let's go. This is good. Working on coordination. Again, hands up. You're gonna bring to the left and the right side. Let's go. So essentially, what you're doing here, you grab someone's head and you go. You bring the knee to the head. Sorry, but that's the visual. Keep going. sleep at least seven to eight hours of sleep sleep is super important for every process that happens in your body and especially if you're trying to get strong lean fit lose weight whatnot sleep is super important so make sure you get good quality sleep i will see you tomorrow same time same place adios thanks, thanks for watching subscribe to get fit with
with Gosha and like our videos.